said you better go out there and film them coming in. Lynn was recording. I don't know if she still is. Okay. Did you? Yeah. Hello. <laughs> well, you guys get cozy. Yeah, we're breaking here. Yep. It's been empty most of the day, so All right. just waiting on you. met with the Wondering Wagners today. The Wondering Wagners came in um, to our campground today and they're staying here for a few nights. Um, we've got to know them just by following their channel on YouTube, Mike and Lynn, and their two dogs, Piper and Guy. And they got to meet Drax today. He's super hot and he's hanging out in front of a fan because he's a princess. So, we're gonna go, I think we're gonna go swimming with the Wagners here in a little bit because it's about 90 degrees and we are all hot and sweaty. What, honey? Hank's watching Minions. We're swimming? Maybe. Oh, he heard the S word. Hank has had yogurt. Come here. I'm full. You're full? <laughs> okay. Did you get any in your mouth? <laughs> Until next time. Wagners were just here videoing in our rig. Literally as we were standing in here videoing with them, lightning struck, thunder was happening. They ran over to put their awning in because there's a storm coming. I don't think it's gonna last very long, but the mountain is slowly disappearing over there. Hank says he hopes his bike is okay over there. It sounded like it hit a tree, the lightning did or something. So we're gonna wait this storm out, possibly go swimming after it's over. Isn't that right? Oh wait, TV's on, he's not gonna pay attention. How's it look out there? Good. Stormy? Less, yeah, less of our things are out right now. Is it windy? No. No, it's not. Not a tree branch moving. Creepy. Where are we going? Uh, to their camper. We're gonna go to their camper. We're gonna go over to Wondering Wagner's camper to see Mike and Lynn Wagner's. Is it a Super C? Yes, I think it's a Super C. Lily didn't hear me in the back. He's putting the dog in the bedroom. We're leaving him back there. Hopefully he doesn't get into anything while we are gone. Are we go see a camper? Yeah. Okay. Lay down, Jack. Looks like a volcano erupting. <laughs> it's a wraith? A wraith. Is it like Nexus or something? <laughs> Nexus. Nexus wraith. I think that's right. Nexus. Nexus wraith. 
Knock, knock. <laughs> Guy and Piper. Come on. 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 We are here with Mike and Lynn Wagner, checking checking out their rig. You know, this is a lot less room. <laughs> <laughs> a lot less slides in this one. They had a floor plate similar to this that had opposing slides. The dinette was on a slide, but it didn't have a washer dryer. So <laughs> we chose to go with this floor plate instead because the washer dryer was more important. So, yeah. uh, How's your How's your headroom when you stand all the way up off the steps? There we go. Oh, good. Yeah, that's good. Very good. What is it? Seven foot? It's gotta be. Yeah. It must be. You gotta take my around here, then. <laughs> yeah. What's up, bud? What do you see? You see a bed? There's all their magnets. That's cool. Yeah, you can sleep a lot of people in here if you wanted to. They screwed up this build when they put this together because this dinette, you see how far out it sticks. When you fold out the couch, it hits right here on the edge. Oh, so you can't yeah. fold the couch all the way out. So they gave us two options. They said we can switch out your dinette with the shorter one, or we can switch out the couch with theater seats. But we like the couch, we like the dinette, and we don't ever have to sleep next to people. So we just left it, just left it the way it is. Yeah. It was supposed to be built with theater seats. So. Oh, yeah. Yeah, and you need to fit people up there. That's that's our catch-all. That's our catch-all. Yeah, <laughs> that's a pretty big space. So, yeah, it is. It's a big space. We we have slept up there before, so we like, can't sleep up there. Well, we didn't mean to sleep up there. <laughs> when we got this, we just laid up there. The corner of the bunks comfortable, oh, yeah. and we just laid up there with all sorts of We're like, this is great. The dogs can't get up here. They're like we're just gonna relax for a second. Yeah, because the dogs couldn't get to us. It was great. Oh, they didn't mean it. <laughs> <laughs> the only real complaint of a Super C is like when you're parked, that space up there is just kind of. Oh, uh, yeah. Those seats don't swing around. No, it's just kind of wasted yeah. space. Some we people have it. modified those seats to spin around and yeah. face the coach, but mm -hmm. what good is the passenger seat going to be if you spin it around? Right. Yeah. You're not going to see the TV or anything. Right. But, but we're, it's just us. So. Yeah, it's just the two of us and two dogs. We're contemplating taking out the dinette completely and having her sister's husband and his dad build us like a cabinet to go there. Oh my God. There's some storage and stuff like that. I've been be thinking good. about going to lithium batteries. And the problem with lithium batteries is when it gets cold out, you can't charge it. Well, they won't take a charge. Yeah. Okay. So you got to keep it warm. So uh, we can build in a space at the bottom of that for lithium batteries. Yeah, I see that. I want to do that too. It's not in our budget. Yeah. Yeah, <laughs> yeah it's like a thousand dollars a battery. Yeah. I know that's what you think when you see everybody give these tours and stuff. They're like, here's our bank of like 12 of these batteries. And you just think in your head, like, ching, ching, ching. Yeah. Right. I think we'll probably only have one or two. Uh, <laughs> one or two batteries, maybe like 400 watts of solar. It would be plenty for us. Yeah. Because if we had run the AC, we've got a generator. Yeah. Well, I thought that too. Yeah. I gotta keep the generator up to date a little better than I did. <laughs> we'd like to put in a 12 volt fridge. Oh yeah. Like I like our residential fridge. Yeah, so we still have mm -hmm. the LP and electric oh, fridge. I mean, it works. Yeah. I like it because then we can move back really easily. We're right. good with my inverter for two nights. Yeah. But generally, I can turn the uh, generator on sometime and charge back up. Can we go get my light on? No, we're not going to go in there. We're going to go out in just a minute. It probably wouldn't take you much solar to keep this battery light on so. my bike. We will when we leave. I've thought about it a lot. If we would end up being more, in it more than what we are, I would, that's one of the first things I would do. Yeah. We've got the room for it. There's so much room up there in that basement area. And it's already got, it's got a little baby solar panel up there, just like a triple charger. Mm -hmm. But I'd have to replace everything that's on it. Yeah. It's a bit bigger. And there was one of our subscribers who wanted to do a full, like, solar install on this. We're in, I mean, we want, we want to do it, but 
there was some other things that we just had to take care of first and stuff like that. But and I don't know, how many watts of solar do you have on this? Do you remember? His entire roof was painted. Oh my gosh. And in the bedroom they put in a mini split. Right. Wow. So oh, air that's air. what uh what was his name? Oh yeah, Goodwin. Ben. Ben Goodwin. Ben Goodwin. Have you seen his channel? Uh -huh. Well, we we camped with him in the uh, Badlands. The Badlands. And we went over and seen his. He built all of his battery stuff. Like he had an insane amount of batteries, and he built it all himself. Yeah, that's what this guy did. Underneath their bed was all the electronics yeah. for the solar charger and the lithium batteries. Oh, yeah. oh my gosh. And he said he runs his mini split off of solar. Well, his. This one was a factory mini split system. So it was all built in and then it had cassettes like this in the front and back that all ran off the one. Yeah. But he ran it all off solar. He said he'd been on solar for like three months and never even plugged in. Yeah. So it looks great. Yeah. It's, that's the direction it's headed. Yeah. Because lithium keeps getting cheaper and cheaper. Well, now they got the lithium iron phosphate batteries, which are like half the price yeah. of lithium. And still performing the same. Yeah. yeah. What you think, Hank? <laughs> it's quiet in here. Yeah. yeah. Your air is a lot quieter than mine. One thing we didn't notice till loading up at 5.30 or 6 on Friday morning is that we have something brand new on the truck. We got tagged by Wondering Wagners. 